Removing carbon emissions from the air is one of the fastest growing remedies for global warming. But what do you do with all of that captured carbon? Diana Olick explains in her continuing series on climate startups. Diana? Well, Kelly, we've seen a lot of creative uses for captured carbon, from making bubbles in soda to distilling vodka. And now, shall we say, another brilliant idea. Lab-grown diamonds are becoming big business, forecast to reach $50 billion globally by 2030. Names like WD, Clean Origin, Vibranium, and a startup called Ether, which takes diamond sustainability to a new level. Every Ether diamond that has been grown until now has been from carbon that was captured through a direct air capture process in the Swiss Alps. Shearman says this makes them even greener than the competition. It also makes them pricier than other lab-grown diamonds, but less so than mine stones. He describes Ether's proprietary process as follows. Captured carbon is converted to what they call atmospheric methane. That is then injected into a chemical vapor reactor, and over the course of about four weeks, the diamond grows atom by atom. So at the end, we're left with something that uh, is unparalleled in its environmental footprint and meets the strictest requirements for cut clarity, uh, color, and carat weight for uh, you know, even the world's top luxury brands. Ether's diamonds are certified by the International Gemological Institute. The company is currently using carbon purchased from Climeworks, a carbon capture firm that operates this plant in Switzerland, but says they are now pursuing carbon sources in large cities like Paris and New York, a strategy particularly enticing to investors. Imagine you're proposed to in Milan and in the future, the ability to actually take the air uh, out of um, the, you know, the Milanese air that day and then putting that on your on your ring finger. In addition to Helena, Ether is backed by Trirec, Soundwaves, Kozla Ventures, and Social Impact Capital. Total funding, $18 million. Ether CEO says the company is now expanding beyond diamonds to produce industrial materials like carbon black, graphite, and graphene from atmospheric carbon. They've also shifted their diamond business from direct to consumer to B2B. Kelly? Does it, Diana, take a lot of energy in order to convert the carbon dioxide gas uh, into the diamond? Less so than other lab-grown diamonds. In fact, that's why they say they're greener than other lab types. And it, while they do have to use some, obviously, to create the diamond, it is much less than you would emit by mining or, as we said, other lab-grown types. Would, would, you know, would people have any issue Trying taking to figure the, out. Uh... The... <laughs> Diana, they're using coal to fire up the grid to use the energy no, to make the no, diamonds. You sure? That's not how it works. No. Okay, they might, work that, way. might work that way in India and, and China because that, that's you got to power the grid somehow, right? Right, but they're saying that they're using less energy to produce these diamonds, and it's offset by the fact that they're using carbon emissions taken from the air. Yeah, I wonder net 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 net. How much does a diamond cost? Is it similar to the cost of a of a regular? I don't want to. No, it's, so it's grown. in the middle. It's in the middle. So it's more expensive than a lab grown diamond because it takes more to do that carbon capture that they're having to buy but from what companies about a like regular Pine diamond. It is slightly cheaper than a regular diamond because it's more expensive to mine a diamond. Diana, you, you know, my 25th anniversary is uh, next week. And I, if, if you make too many of these damn things, seriously. We have just given you I'm gonna, the perfect idea. I'm going to be really upset if you flood the market with these diamonds. I'm going to be really, that's all I'm telling you. I mean, diamonds are scarce, aren't they? That we're going we're gonna to start making them? Please don't. Well, what if you're saving the planet by doing it, Joe? I'm not, uh, I, 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 Isn't that a little I think worth the planet, it? I think the planet will be okay, uh, Diana. But, that, uh, but that, you, know, you know how I feel about that. <laughs> Uh, uh, yes, maybe I humans, do. but not humans. I know, we'll all be dead. Um, but that's, that's life anyway. I uh, think you should get a, a CO2 diamond for, yeah, for 25th anniversary. I think you should. I think you, ether. I think ether should hook you up.